this train. Fine tune of the location of the train here so we can make this pick. Ray, what's the, what's the capacity of this crane in this configuration? 240 tons. 240 tons? Oh, less than that. 220? This is 275. 275. 275? Just curious. A million, a million, a million tons. <laughs> Kind of critical that you get this crane in the right place, so it's within capacity and the job. Look at the truss, go from there, all the way over to there. What's your, what's your job here, Rob Brian? What are you going to be doing? Re-rig? Yeah. Jump it down for another uh, another pull, right? Yep. yep. That's what Brian's going to be doing with his partner. All right, so now we're inside the span here. This is oh, this is uh, what it looks like inside the span. It goes all the way back to the Zakem Bridge, which is, uh, I don't know, a quarter of a mile away. I'm guessing. thousand feet, 1,500, a couple of thousand feet, I don't know. And you can see the uh, tendons that uh, contain, most, most of them contain 19 wires, seven strand wires that go through each of these black tubes. And they go, each span has, has these. Some you can't see, they're in the precast down below and on top of us. But uh, they go through these blisters right here, which are very big chunk of concrete that kind of uh, is strong enough to hold up the, se uh, the segments, you know. These tubes are full of grout. They pump grout into these tubes, so the, the wires are um, uh, waterproof and weatherproof. And they, they're the heads of the tendons going the other way. And the wedges are inside there that hold each strand of wire. As our final destination is this uh, right here. There's a good look at the cherry picker that's going to pull the cable. It's all the way down to this point here. The cable runs through the, the snatch block. And it goes up to another snatch block and it pulls the line that's connected to the truss here. And uh, it'll take a couple of pulls to get it to where the triple line's gonna pick it up. Okay, Ray says we're ready to roll, yeah? I'm gonna start moving this truss.
actually rolling downstairs on these uh, Hillman rollers uh, assemblies, which are right, right here. to wait for the train to go by we can't move the truss while the train's moving below us flag can tell us when to stop down there, make sure they don't get hung up. Hard to see shooting into the sun like this. But the guys are right there uh, keeping an eye on the uh, cart, making sure it stays on the line. Doesn't wander off the, the span up there. They can steer it by pulling on the come-alongs and pulling, uh, twisting that uh, seat bracket, uh, whichever way they have to twist it, make it go straight. The other end is suspended off of that, the other end of the truss, suspended off that seat bracket. See the uh, cherry picker is uh, hold it as far as it can. Now we have to re-grab the truss, re-hook re re it up so we get another pull. Ronnie and Kegel and Brian Fitzgerald have disconnected the uh, the rigging, uh, and they're going to bring it all the way back here and we'll hook it up again so we can get another pull. Let's see, uh, Ryan is the uh, boom lift master, maneuvering that boom lift into position. Ronald Kegel, the man. <laughs> We're going to hook up this uh, hook right here. Right, right here. I got to have my gloves on. All right. Nor Norman's bundled up with this 40 degree frigid weather. Give it a bridge clamp to Johnny. Norman. We'll put the bridge clip on, clamp on to keep the hook in place. All right, we got our hooks on, huh? Now you can see that we've uh, moved the other end off the pair bracket. Larry Morin and Ronnie Williams in their basket. They're going to hook up the triple nine. To the truss. Now that the truss is uh, close enough to the triple nine. So we can pick it. That's a good look at the uh, Hillman rollers that uh, we use to uh, set the stone on. Uh, the precast pieces on and uh, get to roll them in position and move them uh, back and forth as needed to line them up. They're all packed up right now for this launch. And Brian putting the uh, getting ready to tie off to the truss. He's going to be tied off here and go out there to hook up the truss. 